welcome back to my channel thank you so much for watching so in today's story i'm gonna show you this dark smoky eye it's a really dramatic look but i love it and in this look i'm using the Gwen stefani palette by urban k so i hope that you enjoy and if you want to see how i got this look keep on watching and let's begin so let's get started i'm gonna apply the shadow base soft toker by mac all over my lid I'm using this cream color brush by Sigma and I'm gonna spread this eyeshadow base everywhere the eyeshadows go For this look, I'm gonna use the Gwen Stefani palette by Urban Decay and I'm gonna start applying this color here, this one, with a fluffy brush in my crease and a little bit in my outer corner just to blend. This will be my transition shade. Now from the same palette, I'm going to apply this color here in my outer corner. This palette is so pigmented and have a nice colors. I really enjoy this. And then I'm gonna use the same fluffy brush that I was using before and blend these edges. Now I'm gonna apply the same color in my lower lash line. In my brow bone, I'm gonna apply this color here just a little bit to give it a little more shine. So I'm gonna apply just here in my brow bone, just to highlight a little bit. In my tear duct area, I'm gonna apply this color here. It's a light pinky shadow. I'm gonna apply it here. Blending to the next color. corner I'm gonna apply a little bit of this black eyeshadow mm -hmm. 
The fake lashes that I used are the Style Jade by Huda Beauty. And now for my blush, I'm gonna apply the color How Deep Is Your Love by Too Faced. And the highlighter that I'm going to use is the color Audrey. To moisturize my lips, I'm going to apply the first Sally in my lips. I'm going to apply with a brush. I'm gonna line my lips using the lip liner by Gerard Cosmetics in the shade Luna. And for my liquid lipstick, I'm going to use the color Drive Seat by Smashbox. That's it my angels, thank you so much for watching, I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial, I really love to create this look for you. If you have any ask or suggestions, let me know in the comments below and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you still didn't and follow me on Instagram to see more pictures of my work and I'll see you in the next tutorial.